Hey loves, and welcome to Heart to Heart Love Messages. My name is Crystal. If you're new here, welcome to the channel. If you are already subscribed here, welcome back. So tonight I have a love message from your person. I will be pulling from this deck here just to see how your person is currently feeling, how they are currently viewing you and or your connection, as well as any other important messages that they may have for you at this time, okay? So let's go ahead and get into it. Let's get a very clear and concise message directly from their heart space. Okay, so the first message that we have here is, I wasn't ready for you. And I'm getting confession very, very clearly with this card here. So there's a masculine in your energy field who is extremely good with masking their emotions, especially when it comes to you, Divine Feminine. There's something about your energy or the way that they feel in your presence that makes them want to shrink, okay? There's something very powerful about the balance of your energies when you come in contact with them. This is someone that, whether they have expressed this to you or not, you caught them completely off guard. So I don't know how this connection initially started, how it is that you presented yourself, what it is that you said to them. There's something very, very powerful about your energy where immediately upon coming in contact with you, your person kind of sized you up and realized that they were not ready for you, okay? This is not something that they verbalized to you. This is not something that their body language conveyed, but this is definitely picking up on their underlying energy or their thought process when you were in their presence. I'm also getting that this masculine had a way of conducting themselves when they were around you to mask that they were not ready for you. So they could have presented themselves or engaged you in one or two ways. They may have come off very avoidant, very stoic or unemotional, or they may have been a type of masculine to use humor to try to cover up what it is that they were really feeling. And this is based on the way that you would make them feel in your presence. But lately, your person is really at this place where something about you is making them want to open up. So although this may be someone that you can easily read from the outside looking in, there's definitely something going on inside of them that's bothering them about you or your connection. Something that they may not have come into awareness of until now. So if you feel like this masculine has been hiding something from you or just kind of putting on a front when they're in your presence or when you speak to them, then you are definitely right. You could also be picking up on the fact that your person wants to confess to you at this time. You may be feeling their energy. If you have any type of connection to them via social media, if you, you know, navigate the same circles, something about their energy is becoming very, very heavy. And if you pay attention to them when they're in your presence, it's almost like you can read that they feel something about you specifically right now. And this is kind of motivating this confession. Okay, let's get the next message here. Okay, so the next message that we have is pay attention to the signs. Hmm. I'm getting regret with this card here. Heavy regret. And this is why this masculine's energy is coming through very serious. They were not like this in the past. Yeah, I keep picking up on the energy of humor. So this could be a masculine that just goes with the flow. They seem very, very nonchalant. They seem very unserious about life, about love, about connection, maybe even about you, Divine Feminine. But this is the one thing that they regret when it comes to you. I'm getting clearly that this is a masculine that received very blatant signs about you. And because of their views or the way that they view the universe or the unseen realm or even connections, they literally ignored every single sign that they received or they could have took them for granted. 
So for some reason, all of this is kind of hitting them like a ton of bricks. All of this is coming back around to them. So they may be thinking about you a lot at this time. I keep getting something about social media as well. So this is someone that may have limited access to you. Maybe they have pictures of you. Maybe you hang around in the same circles. What's interesting is that there's been kind of this flip of their energy. So with this card, pay attention to the signs. This masculine literally went from being a person who took everything as a joke, who was very unserious about your connection, about the stage of your connection, to now they feel like everything is a sign. And when it comes to you and your energy divine feminine, there's so much regret about the way that they handled you in the past that now they're kind of going overboard with this. Okay, it's like anything that they hear that's remotely close to your energy or reminds them of you in some way, they think that this is a sign. Okay, I'm getting something about music. So there could be a specific song, a specific lyric that they hear in a song where they instantly think about you or now they feel like the universe is sending them signs about you. And the only reason that they're kind of zeroing in on this is because this is definitely an aspect of the connection that they took for granted, okay? There could also be a difference here in how you both live your lives. Maybe you come off as someone who is very, very spiritual. You came into this connection. You felt guided. You felt very much so intrigued by this masculine Maybe the differences is what attracted the both of you, but the more that you begin to speak to them, it's almost like the way that they would engage you became very, very unserious at some point in your journey. And that could have definitely made you question if you were on the same page or if this masculine was in fact compatible for you for where you were on your journey, okay? Let's get the next message here. Okay, so the next message that we have here is, I've been looking for you. Yeah, this, this is someone who is heavily in your energetic field or they're trying to be, okay? I also feel like this is something that they want to confess to you or they want to open up to you about as well because there's this kind of hidden energy with this here. So they definitely have their eyes on you. This is someone that feels like they're being led in your direction, and they feel like the signs that they are receiving is slowly guiding them and bringing them closer to you. But this is definitely happening in a very subtle way because anytime there's a universal influence when it comes to the alignment of two people, this will most likely be initiated by the masculine. So Divine Feminine, you may feel this internally, but your person is definitely beginning to see evidence of this in their reality. It may even seem like every single sign that they receive is telling them something or giving them some type of specific information about you. There's definitely something sticking out about their approach now. So this is someone who may have thought that this was a very unserious type of connection. They could be someone who doesn't really see the spiritual significance in certain things, but they're taking this very serious. It definitely feels like this is an aspect of your connection that they're becoming a little bit more intentional about, okay? I'm also getting heavy energy in their environment as well. So it may literally feel like this is manifesting in real time. So they may be speaking and interacting with other people, but for some reason, your energy keeps coming through. And it's coming through in a way that they can't really question. They know your energy signature well enough to pick up on it, even if it's coded in different people, places, and things. So this is a huge indicator that not only is the mark you left on them permanent, but it's also very easy for them to identify in the physical realm. And they're essentially using these signs as green flags that let them know that they're headed in the right direction, which is toward you. Okay. So if you're wondering what this masculine has been up to, I feel like there is a huge difference between what it is they're showing externally and how it is they're really feeling about you on the inside. It's almost like they're trying to keep this concealed for some reason, but you definitely have their attention at this time. Okay. 
Let's get the next message here. So the next message that we have here is you are a complete mystery. Yeah. This is definitely tapping into your demeanor, the way that you come off divine feminine. Your person will probably never say this to you, but there's something about you that scares them. And this is not in a negative way, but you challenge this masculine in a way where they never really know what to expect from you. But what really scares them the most are the thoughts that they have when you are away from them. And this is what's really driving them at this time. You have this very powerful level of silent influence on this masculine. And it's like there's something very open-ended that you bring to this connection that literally forces this masculine to not only think about what they want, but you also make them think about who they want to be. And this is something that a lot of feminine energies may get wrong when it comes to masculine energy in general. This is also how their selection process is very different from the feminine. Because honestly, this masculine, they may use their humor to mask what it is that they're really feeling because they're actually mysterious also. And just the masculine energy in general can be really tricky to navigate because they're action oriented. So you have to pay very close attention to them. Rarely will they just tell you how they feel. They'll most likely show you with their actions. And in this way, I think they're realizing that you match their energy and this is what scares them. So you are a feminine energy who is not very impulsive with your actions or your speech. You simply pay attention to them and then you act accordingly. And it's almost like this masculine feels like they're staring into a mirror. And not only does this keep them on their toes, but it also fascinates them, okay? So your ability to keep this person guessing is definitely an element that you bring to this connection that just heightens the intensity. So with this energy, you are a complete mystery. This is literally how your masculine is feeling right now. It feels like they have completely met their match and they can feel this intensity when you're in their presence and when you're at a distance. It's almost as if all the time that you spent with this masculine was accounted for, like you planted a seed. And this is definitely giving you a closer look at not only their mental and emotional process, but also how this seed is kind of growing and taking form in your person's psyche. Okay, this is something that fascinates them, but it also scares them because this is an element or a trait that you possess that they also possess. This is someone that may definitely use their humor or use this ability to be unserious or very nonchalant in a way that kind of throws you off and keeps you from kind of penetrating the heart space. But if they were to be honest, this is how they feel about you. This is a connection where your person may have entered this connection not really understanding where it would go, what you would represent, you know, where you came from, but they definitely were not ready for something serious. And it's almost as if because they are admitting this to themselves, now they're being hit with all of these things that transpired in your connection. And they're kind of looking into and reading their own energy to see why they were responding to you in the way that they were. Okay, let's get the next message here. Okay, so the next message that we have here is my heart knows you. <laughs> yeah. Another element that you bring to this connection or another reason that you scare this masculine is because you made them comfortable. Now they're in this place emotionally where they don't really want to go deep with anyone. So if this is something that you're worried about, Divine Feminine, you really shouldn't be. They definitely have boundaries in place or like some kind of system where they know who gets what. And the way this energy is coming through, it's like they want you to know that their heart has become comfortable with you. And this is not something that they take lightly. This is also someone who thinks that you have a beautiful heart, Divine Feminine. And although there could be parts of you that you haven't really shared with them, from what they've seen, you've kind of earned their trust. 
I'm also getting respect very, very clearly. So this could be a masculine who is big on respect, but they really respect how you carry yourself. The fact that you don't give away too much information, the fact that you know how to match energy. If they pull back, you pull back. I just keep picking up on that mirror effect where oftentimes there is an imbalance of the energy because when the masculine will pull back, the feminine will feel like that's an invitation to give and to overpour. But I'm getting that you literally match their energy in this way. And this is something that they really, really respect, even if they've never said something to you. This is also an aspect of your personality that makes them ruminate. They wonder how you became this way, what it is that you've been through in life, how it is that you can exude this kind of confidence as the feminine energy and really hold your position and stand your ground in moments, okay? So however this person presented in the beginning of your connection, maybe this is someone that you lost contact with, their energy still feels a little close to you in some way. So they definitely have some type of limited access to you, but whatever it is that you showed them, this stood out to them more than anything. So this is a masculine energy who may be really attracted to you physically, divine feminine, but your character, is what's speaking volumes to them right now. This is what has them paying attention to the signs, the sinks. This is what has them really wanting to be close to you in your energetic field. It's because in some way, by you matching their energy, it's almost like you won them over in a sense. And all of this is like hitting them. But wherever they stand right now, that's not the person that you met, okay? This is a very different energy that's coming through. Because clearly in the past, they could have been very unemotional, very just sarcastic about the energy of your connection, or they use this in a way to really mask their emotions or to really go deep with you. But this is clearly what's happening under the surface at this time right now, okay? No matter how they may be presenting to you physically. Let's get the last message here. Okay, so the last message that we have here is trying to impress you. Yeah. I feel like this is the one thing that has stayed consistent with this masculine. You're the type of feminine energy that makes people feel like they have to impress you. Even if you deep down feel like they don't have to. So this is definitely picking up on how people judge you or how people perceive you to be based upon how you present. So even if you feel that this masculine should have just done what was natural to them, the way that your energy is coming through, this is just a testament to how they view you. They view you as someone that they need to put their best foot forward with. This feels like this masculine has changed in a way, divine feminine. Not only their appearance, but their level of substance. So you may not be able to tell just by looking at them, but I'm getting the minute that they open their mouth, they may literally catch you off guard. And this is a reflection of where they currently are on the inside. This is someone that is also really big on impressions. So the way that they present is very, very important. This could also be important to you, Divine Feminine, not in a very superficial way, but also in a way where you really read into what it is that you see to kind of gauge where a person is mentally and emotionally. So this may be tapping into your gift of being able to read people's energy. So no matter how this masculine shows up for you in the near future, whether this be physically or energetically, I'm getting that you'll definitely be able to read that they are trying to impress you by appealing to your soul, appealing to the way that you think, your outlook on the world, or even your self-interest. But you'll also be able to pick up on their underlying energy as well to see where they're really coming from. And if this is really a reflection of where they are on their journey mentally and emotionally. So if you're wondering what your person is really going through, how they're processing your connection, this is someone that wants to make another impression upon you. This is someone that feels like how they presented themselves was not a direct reflection 
of you or even themselves. And the energy or the image that they left you with, it really doesn't sit well with them. So now they're really sitting back and trying to pay attention to all of the things that they kind of overlooked when they did have your attention. Maybe you're focused on something else, Divine Feminine. You could be pouring all your energy into yourself. You could be opening your options, you know, allowing love to find you in many different ways. But there's definitely a masculine who's still on your radar, who's still paying attention to you, and who's still trying to seek out your energy in this way. Because although when they were in your energy, they were not ready for you, Whatever it was that you showed them or how you presented yourself, you definitely left one hell of an impression on them, okay? And this is why they are seeking you out so much at this time. So now they're trying to come at you from a totally different angle in order to get your attention or to hold your attention in a different way than they did in the past, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and end the reading here. If you resonated with this message, please be sure to hit the like button on your way out. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to the channel and I will see you all in the next video. Bye!